There are over 100 Fortnite crossover skins a day, and with the help of over 15,000 of you guys, we're ranking them worst to best, starting with Deathstroke. In our first spot, we have this DC assassin who has a pretty slick character design and stands out when it comes to Fortnite crossovers. But as cool as this guy is, he's still only the 30th. I just shows us how much you guys like the other skins, and I guess that brings us to the Borderlands crossover. Now, when it came out, it kind of split the community, but it looks like as time has passed, a lot of players realize that they actually really like the crossover. Some say the skin reminds them of the Pandora POI from Season X. But when it comes to pure style, that's where Kratos shines. This guy is loved by a ton of Fortnite players, and there's no surprise there, he looks sick. Especially with that golden PS5 there, and I mean, man, it is just so clean. Some people love Kratos for his design, and others just love the God of War games and are so happy to see him brought to life in Fortnite. And our first superhero skin has arrived in the form of The Flash. He is absolutely loved by a ton of fans of both the show, the movies, and the comics, and they all come together to appreciate the fact that they can play as him in Fortnite. But because he's number 27, it technically means you guys have ranked him as the worst superhero skin in the list. And so luckily, we're going to dive a little bit deeper and find out who the favorites are, and that starts with the Alien set. Both the Ripley and Xenomorph skins are adored by people, and honestly, these are also a personal favorite of my own. The Alien movies are awesome, and Epic Games nailed it with this set. I mean, both skins look great. And from horror to the King of Thunder, next up we have Thor. People really like this skin, mostly because of the comic that he came in, as well as his entire set. He has an amazing exclusive glider, and his pickaxe is something that every Marvel fan was asking for. I mean, it looks like all the Thor fans got something they wanted. And for those who weren't into superheroes and just wanted their favorite creator in game, you guys have chosen Laser Beam as your 24th best crossover skin. Some people love Laser just because he's one of their favorite YouTubers and others love the way his skin is designed, especially with that launch break emote. I am a fan of that one for sure. But it turns out the community is even more of a fan of the Terminator set. This one was of course one of the surprise crossovers of season five and it's one of the rare collabs that is a classic movie. A lot of crossovers we have in Fortnite are for films or games that recently came out, but Terminator is a 90s classic, especially with just how intimidating he is. People love this guy. But let's actually talk about a modern crossover because sure people love how classic Terminator is, but it seems that they love their favorite TV shows more, and that brings us to the Walking Dead set. Michonne and Daryl were yet another season five surprise, and a lot of people were extremely excited about that. Rumor has it though, we have more Walking Dead skins on the horizon as well, so who knows, might have to make a part two and update this list soon. But for now, the crossovers get even more popular as we head to our next Marvel superhero and probably one of the most iconic of the Avengers. Of course, I'm talking about Captain America. And while he is by far one of the most popular Avengers, he's only the 21st most popular crossover skin. You might be asking why, and it turns out people love him in the movies, but as a Fortnite skin, I mean, compared to all these other insanely wacky universes, it's no surprise that the community has put him here. Who knows, maybe if we got a Chris Evans version, he'd be a little bit higher. And he falls just behind the Star Wars set. These were the skins that were released during the Fortnite X Star Wars event back in Chapter 2 Season 1. It started with the Imperial Stormtrooper, and then we had the addition of Rey, Finn, and the Sith Trooper. And just a month later, Fortnite added the last of these skins with Kylo Ren and Zori Bliss. I mean, there were so many skins. But that's why this is the set that brings us to our top 20 and with 19, we go back to Marvel with Wolverine. Now, we've had a lot of secret skins in Chapter 2, but players especially love this guy. I mean, he comes with an awesome range of variants, and some people just straight up are obsessed with his built-in emote. But the real respect has to go to Black Panther, who sits at number 18 in our list. For a lot of people, Black Panther is their favorite superhero, and he was extremely requested back in Season 4. I mean, everyone wanted him in the game, and Fortnite delivered. Not to mention, they absolutely did his design justice. I mean, he looks awesome. And he's right next to everyone's favorite supervillain, Harley Quinn. Now, there is a ton of versions of Harley, which is why she's just so popular. I mean, for people who love her comic book version, they get that. For the fans of Birds of Prey, they get her design from that as well, so it's no wonder she's so high on the list. And yet, it just gets better and better next up to someone who literally just released, and he's the most recent collab on the entire list. Of course, we're talking about J Balvin. Despite being so new, J Balvin has made his way extremely high on this list because everyone is going crazy for his set right now. Not only does he have some of the coolest variants of any Icon series skin, but he brings an awesome emote glider and pickaxe with him. But it turns out not even J Balvin could break into our top 15, which is stacked full of the best crossovers that Fortnite has to offer, starting with the Stranger Things set. Even though the show is full of awesome characters, Fortnite found a way to only add two and still be extremely well received by the community. A lot of people think that the Demo Gorgon skin is actually one of the most underrated outfits in Fortnite right now. And fans of the show are still loving playing as Hopper, especially while they get excited for the new season of Stranger Things that's coming out soon. I can't wait. But moving from a show about the 80s to a game from the 80s, we have the Street Fighter set. I mean, you can't go anywhere on social media right now without seeing people talking about these skins. They are loved by the Fortnite community. Both people who grew up on Street Fighter and kids who have never played it love this set and has actually gotten a lot of Fortnite fans trying out Street Fighter for the first time. And I know what you're thinking. You wouldn't think the crossovers could get better from here, but they can 
again, and they absolutely do. If you think Street Fighter is giving Fortnite players nostalgia, then just wait until you give them the Marshmallow set. Now, I think a lot of people have ranked Marshmallow high, not just because of his costume, but because it reminds them of the first ever concert we got and how Marshmallow paved the way for all of these icon series skins we have today. You know what? I mean, fair enough. But being first at something doesn't mean you're the best, and that's why Marshmallow has been overtaken by the Lara Croft skin. Like many crossovers, a lot of people, including myself, grew up playing Tomb Raider, and they just love Lara Croft as a character, so the chance to play as her in Fortnite really resonated with people. It also really helped that it was a part of the primal season, so they got to practice their bone hunting skills. I mean, it seriously was a perfect crossover for a lot of people. And yet it has nothing on what's next. I mean, sure, Lara Croft is one of the coolest video game characters out there, but she ain't no John Wick. And no, the Reaper skin doesn't count. We're talking about the actual John Wick skin, which came out in season nine. Fortnite literally went from a small game that made a parody of John Wick to getting the man himself in the game in just under a year. It's pretty incredible, but not enough to get him into our top 10, unfortunately, because that title goes to the man himself, the Mandalorian. Despite all the other Star Wars skins in the game, Mando cemented himself as the Star Wars skin, and he is one of the most popular crossover outfits in Fortnite right now. Not only did he shock everyone when season five came out, but he brought baby Yoda along for the ride. And that's if you ignore the fact that you could even upgrade his armor. So those are the reasons why you guys put him as your 10th best crossover skin. But as you know, it only gets better from here. And that's why number nine goes to the Cape Crusader himself, Batman. And like no specific version, just all of them, because there's a ton of range and variety with these Batman skins. It was kind of hard to pick a single one. So you guys chose all of them. Some people love the Dark Knight versions. Some adored the armored Batman Zero style. And honestly, that's what makes him so great. But even then, Batman is just the ninth most popular. A superhero skin that pushes Batman to the side is actually Iron Man. He was the tier 100 skin for season four, and I mean, rightfully so. Iron Man's outfit is so well designed, and his emote where you can switch between Tony Stark and the Iron Man suit, it's just perfect. Somehow though, with both Batman and Iron Man being so popular, there's actually a third contender who has beat both of them, and that is Superman. Which is kind of crazy to me, because he only came out this season, but with all the cosmetics in his set, and how iconic he is as a superhero, I mean, it kind of makes sense he comes in at number seven. I would have chosen Iron Man myself, but hey. And so with all the superheroes out of the way, the best is yet to come, starting with one of the most iconic video game characters of all time, Master Chief from Halo. I mean, it was out of the question that Master Chief wouldn't be in the top 10. Too many people adore him, and it's just hard to ignore how much attention he gets. In every lobby, you're bound to find a Master Chief somewhere. I mean, he is really that popular. But even Master Chief gets outshadowed sometimes, and that's by the queen of the icon series herself, Ariana Grande. Since her concert blew everyone away and her set sold like hotcakes in the item shop, Ariana shot to the top of people's lists and has found herself in the top five. But coming in at number four, there's the biggest and baddest supervillain of all. He was also the first ever crossover in Fortnite, and that is Thanos. Now, technically, we only got him as a skin this year, but back in 2018, when the Avengers crossover happened, we actually got to play as Thanos, and it changed the game forever. It is for this reason he has landed so high on your guys' list, but if it's changing the game forever that you're looking for, then our number three spot is dedicated to Travis Scott. The astronomical concert blew up the internet, and to this day, Travis Scott's skin is the most sought after of all time. I mean, you can't go a single day without seeing people begging for him to re-release, and you know, he's not even that rare. And yet our number two spot just has to go to this next guy. He's the king of breaking the fourth wall in the community's favorite Marvel skin, obviously Deadpool. I think it's safe to say he shocked everyone in season two when he became the secret skin and his challenges, the yacht and more just took everyone by surprise. It was so awesome. And before we reveal the number one crossover, we have an honorable mention. And because there are over 100 crossover skins in Fortnite, we could only make this list a top 30 without it being like 45 minutes long. So this is dedicated to all the skins that didn't make the list. We still love you guys, but we know what you're here for. You want to know what's number one. So let's reveal it after asking the community what their favorite crossover skin is. One set stood out above all the rest. And surprisingly, it wasn't a superhero. It wasn't a villain, not even a celebrity. It's actually Rick and Morty, which like, I guess they're technically all the above, but I guess they're not anything specific. So yeah, they only released this season, but they have quickly become the most popular love crossover in Fortnite right now. And with Morty releasing just last week, it keeps getting bigger and bigger. Rumor has it, more is to come, with Summer possibly being in the works. Please, Epic Games, I really love that. I would love an evil Morty variant. But that is every Fortnite crossover skin ranked worst to best. Thanks so much for watching, guys. It's been Tommy and keep it here on Top 5 Gaming.